Sadistic and evil animal abuser Matthew Hurst was spared jail but has been banned from keeping animals for 10 years after the horrifying footage was released of the Wigan resident stamping on his defenseless, innocent dog Congo 15 times and then slamming his head into the floor around 7 times after he had relieved himself inside, evidently because Hurst was too lazy to make sure he could go outside, he just sat on the sofa and watched. Hurst became enraged, stood up and launched his tirade of abuse whilst shouting what are you doing? He then reached down to the dog, who was now lying on the floor, grabbed him by the head and slammed the dog onto the floor again with a lot of force several times. The distressing footage was sent to the RSPCA by a member of the public. Ryan King, who works as an inspector at the animal charity, was shocked when he watched the sickening attack. He said, this is the worst beating I have ever seen during my three years as an RSPCA inspector. After Congo was removed from Hearst's home in Wigan the Black Bull breed dog was thoroughly examined at the RSPCA's animal hospital. Thankfully no serious physical injuries were evident. Analyzing the 38-second video, the vet reported that the dog showed fear and distress for the entire period that he is visible within the footage. The vet said that Hearst's actions in the footage would have caused the dog to suffer fear and distress as well as pain from the 21 blunt force blows to Congo's abdomen, chest and head. The vet concluded that Congo was made to suffer as a consequence of physical abuse and the person responsible for his welfare had failed to protect him from injury, pain and suffering. Hurst has been disqualified from keeping animals for 10 years and sentenced to a 16-week suspended prison sentence after pleading guilty to causing unnecessary suffering to Congo. He will also have to undertake 20 rehabilitation activity requirement days, complete 120 hours of unpaid work pay £2,558 costs and a £120 victim surcharge. The sentencing hearing took place at Wigan Magistrates Court. Congo was signed over to the RSPCA by the defendant and will be rehomed.